Today I'm going to show you guys how you can create tab groups with the Chrome browser. All right, so to explain how they work, let's say you're working on two projects and one of the projects is about cats and the other one is about dogs. Well, if you have so many tabs opened on your Chrome browser, you may want to keep them organized so that um, all the cat tabs will be in one group and all the dog tabs will be in another group. Anyways, let me just show you guys how it works now. So I'll search for cats. Okay, just cat. And uh, yeah, you can start doing all your research and maybe you want to know the class of the cat. Then you can open this in a new tab by long pressing on it and then you open in a tab group. So as you can see, a new tab has been created and um, if I tap this, you see that it is under the same tab. This is a group. If I open more tabs, they will be in this group. If I go back and now I want to create a new tab for dogs. So to create a new tab, I can tap here or tap here. So let me tap here and then I have to head over to wikipedia.com. All right, so I'm on wikipedia.com and now I'm going to search for dogs. All right, so if I tap on this, you'll see now that I have two tab groups. Okay, so I'm just going to open any link that I find here. Let's say this one, I'll long press on it and open in a tab group. And now we have two tabs under one group. All right, so if I tap on this, you will see now that we have two tab groups. This is for cats and this is for dogs. So this is just a good way to handle how you browse the internet. So for example, maybe you accidentally open a tab that is dog related. Well, you can long press on it and then you can come down here to remove from the group. If I tap outside, this is it here. So yeah, now if I want to put it into the group of dogs, then I'll tap and hold it. And then why is it not staying? <laughs> Stay still. Okay, so I can just drop it here. As you can see, we have three tabs within this group. I tap on the group, then I can, yeah, I can move things around. Maybe just want to keep this one here or bring it down. And if I want to move the tab from here to the next group, I can do that. You already saw how I did it. So I'm going to just take it back to the group it used to be by just putting it on this one. And now, they are grouped. So that's basically how you do it. And from here on, you can open as many tabs as you want within a group. So just select any tab you want. And then to add a new tab, you tap here. And you can enter the website you wish to visit. And it's going to open within this tab so that um, you don't have to confuse yourself with other things that are not related to the project you're working on. Now I know I'm just talking about dogs and cats, but uh, that is how you do it. If you're working on projects like, I don't know, gaming or whatever it is, <laughs> cats and dogs are just what came to my head while I was trying to make this video. So that's how you do it. If you guys have questions, just let me know in the comments and I hope you guys found this video helpful. If you guys did, then you can let me know as well in the comments. Alright, take care of yourselves and I'll be seeing you in the next video. Thanks for watching.